hey guys in this video i'm going to be showing you how to make dishwashing liquid so these are the raw materials that i'm going to be using i have water less sdbs cde urea salt formalin which is the preservative perfume and dye so these are the percentages that i'm going to be using i'm making a one liter formulation so I'm going to be having 60% of water, which is 600 milliliters, 20% uh, of SLES, which is 200 milliliters of SLES, 15% of SDBS, which is 150 milliliters, 1% uh, of CDE, which is 10 milliliters of CDE, and then 1% of urea, which is 10 grams of urea, 10 grams of salt, um, 5 milliliters of preservative and 15 milliliters of perfume and then the dye we're going to see how our color looks so I already have the raw materials measured out so I have my water and the slash Okay, so this is 600 milliliters of water and this is 200 milliliters of slash. So firstly, I'm going to pour the slash into the water and, I'm and then I'm going to stir. Okay, so I've added the slash into the water and I'm going to stir. So that's 600 milliliters of water, 200 milliliters of slash. Okay, then the next step I'm going to dissolve the powders into our mixture so I have two powders which is the urea this is 10 grams of urea and 10 grams of salt so I need to dissolve these into the water before the mixture thickens because once the mixture thickens it's difficult to dissolve this powder so I'm going to pour in the urea so this is the urea you can see as the granular texture then I'm going to pour the urea into the water, 10 grams of urea. And this is 10 grams of salt. This is normal salt. Okay, now I'm going to stir. So I need to make sure that these two powders, they dissolve completely into the water before I proceed to adding other chemicals. Okay, so now in our mixture we have water, less salt, and urea. So that is, it's important to know that the less it uh, aids in cleaning. So it's the cleaning agent in our dishwashing liquid. together with the SDBS. The SDBS as well is also a cleaning agent in our dishwashing liquid. Okay, so now I'm going to add the SDBS into the water. So this is the SDVS, which is also the cleaning agent. It's quite thick. It's going to also improve the thickness of our dishwashing liquid as well. So this is 150 milliliters 
of STPS. Okay, now I'm going to give it a stir. So it'll start to notice the mixture, the canning as well. So this is the water slash STBS salts and urea. Okay, now I'm going to add the this is the CDE, which is our foam poster. Ten milliliters of CDE, and then I'm going to also add in our perfume as well. This is fifteen milliliters of perfume. It's lemon perfume. And then I'm going to add our dye as well. So I'm just going to add a pinch of dye. You don't need to use a lot. I think that's fine. It's important to note that the more you stir, the thicker the dishwashing liquid gets. So I've added most of our raw materials. The only thing that is left is to add the preservative. And the preservative sometimes is usually optional. You don't need to add a lot. So this is 5 milliliters of preservative, which is formalin. That's the one that I used. Then I'm going to give it a stir. This is the dishwashing liquid. So it's important to note that I used uh, slash 25. If you use the slash 70, it was going to be even more thicker than this. But I feel like this, this is this works just as well as the one that you used uh, if you had used slash 70. It's just as uh, efficient. Okay, so this is how you make the dish rushing liquid, guys. And then this is the formulation that I used in the raw materials. So I used water, less SDBS, CDE, urea, salt, formalin, dye, and perfume. And then these are the percentages that I used. Okay, so this is our dish rushing liquid. Just going to put it into our dishwashing liquid bottle. Okay, so this is our dishwashing liquid. It's quite an easy formulation to make and quite profitable as well. 
So I made one liter. And then I think I might have overused the dye. It's quite just a little bit too green. But that's fine. So this is the dishwashing liquid. So once it's settles, you start to see the form will eventually uh, phase out and then it should just be glossy liquid. That's how you make dishwashing liquid, guys. Thank you. So if you have any other products that you would like to see next, please comment. And then I'll make sure that I'll try to get to those products. And then I'm also offering this ebook uh, containing 15 formulations of most of the cleaning products that you see on my platforms. So you can support the channel by purchasing this ebook. Thank you, guys.